We we're talking about the tropical forecast update as far as the seasonal forecast. And again, NOAA and Colorado State issued their kind of final adjustment today. Thankfully, nothing is expected over the next five days. And looking at those numbers once again, 14 to 20 for NOAA and 18 for Colorado State. Colorado State is interesting because they issue several forecasts in the before season starts and then during the early part of the season. Their June numbers were 19, 9 and 4. That is the same as what they were forecasting in May. Then July, they increased the numbers to 20, 10, and 5. Then again, a little bit more of a dramatic decrease. They did come down to 18, 8, and 4 for August. So that is for the rest of the season. Again, we've only had three named storms this season, and all three were what we call shorties. They lasted for two days or less. But looking back at this point in the season of the last several seasons, last year we had already had five named storms and one hurricane. In 2020, we had already had nine named storms, two named storms in 2019 and three in 2018. However, when you look at where we were for the season as a whole, all were above average, with maybe 2018 being the closest to average. But again, the early part of the season, June and July, is typically very slow. It isn't until after August that we start to see the activity ramp up. So yes, we have had a very slow start. And yes, at the moment, we're kind of following what would be an average season. It doesn't necessarily bode what will happen for the rest of the month of August, September, and early October. And of course, it only takes one. Thanks.